is joining us on the phone to talk about it is James Friedman of Susquehanna International Group. That is the uh, second ranked, or he is the second ranked analyst on Visa. And uh, James, good to have you with us. Um, and you're seeing, you know, sort of the divergent move in the two stocks right now. For Visa, what is exactly the advantage they get with getting CyberSource? Uh, good morning. Yeah, it's, um, you know, so whether you look at uh, Visa or MasterCard or to some extent American Express, what we refer to as the associations, um, e-commerce has grown as a percentage of the economy. Their representation in e-commerce, though, is lower than it's in the brick-and-mortar world. So to answer your question, the CyberSource acquisition immediately expands Visa's market share in e-commerce. Okay, but they've already got, I mean, doesn't Visa already have online platforms? I think uh, right-click is one of them. I mean, why would, what would CyberSource add to that? Uh, right-click is a um, distributed software model that they launched um, about two months ago. Um, that goes to consumers, and uh, if you want, you can sample it yourself by going to Visa.com and downloading the right-click software. Mm -hmm. CyberSource is a merchant platform uh, has little to do with the consumer end. It's nothing that you would know that you are using when you're transacting on the web. Um, but Visa's presence overall in e-commerce is about a thousand basis points lower than it is in the brick and mortar world. Their perception is that to get there, they'll have to go through the merchant. Okay. And how does this uh, how does this position them vis-a-vis uh, -vis their competitors, as you were just talking about, Mastercard uh, as well as American Express? Uh, well, this is on the gauntlet. I mean, this is a major, you know, this is a major event in the payment cards landscape this morning. Um, so it's going to leapfrog them. I mean, all the companies had had forays with their own e-commerce initiatives, um, generally consumer-driven, but this is going to considerably leapfrog their market share. Also, I should mention that PayPal, which is owned by eBay, is the leading um, merchant transaction solution right. on the internet. And this will close the gap that eBay PayPal enjoys in the market. All right. That was going to be the other question, which is, you know, how does this impact PayPal? Um, okay, James, uh, thanks so much for joining us on the short notice about this Visa deal. Uh, that was a James Friedman of Susquehanna.